Okay, lab one. Basically, lab one, you are going to introduce what a secant line is, what a tangent line is in a presentation. So you're going to make the lecture. Now, you've seen my lectures on this. Uh, you have the textbook. So again, we're going to introduce what a secant line is, what a tangent line is, how their slopes are related to the function. What does the slope of a secant line tell you about a function? What does the slope of a tangent line tell you about a function? And last but not least, how to get an estimate of the sec I'm, I'm sorry, how to get the estimate of a tangent line's slope using the slope or slopes of a secant line. So, how are you going to do this? You have several different options. This is up to you. You can bring in all the creativity you want into this lab. Now, remember, half your lab grade is video conferencing with me. So if you'd like to come uh, make an appointment to video conference with me about this lab and how this works, great. Uh, we can do that. Uh, again, it's half your lab, lab grade is making these appointments. So. What could you do? You can use uh, online graphing calculators. If you could make a video if you want to. You don't have to. You can make a PowerPoint presentation if you'd like to. You can simply make a Word document uh, and bring in anything you'd like to. So any way that you want to introduce this idea of secant lines, tangent lines, and what they are the relationships between them, any way you'd like to make this presentation, you're allowed to. So how am I going to grade your lab? So I will be very, very specific at how your lab will be graded. First of all, do you actually cover all the basic things that I have requested from you on the lab? Let's take a look at these. Okay. So introduces what secant and tangent lines are, uh, what a secant and a tangent line are. You have to do that. That's going to be part of your grade. How the slopes are related to the function. And how the slope of a tangent line can be estimated using the slopes of a secant or slopes of secant lines. If this does not have all of those components, that right there of the points I'm going to award for the lab is 80% of your grade for the lab must accurately do these basic essentials. Uh, are you using examples? Do you accurately convey this? And if you're not sure whether you accurately convey this, ask yourself, would you be satisfied with me making this as my presentation to you for the class for that? Uh, and then last but not least, the last 20% of your grade will be, be determine on the quality on which you make the presentation. Uh, and what I mean by the quality, that's a little bit hard to define because you'll all be using different techniques. So if you're making video, is the quality of your video, does it, does it flow well? Did you make a good video, good use of visual displays? And again, so basically, does it flow nicely in the way, or do I have to really figure out what you're trying to say? Because if I have to figure out what you're trying to say, even if you technically said all the right things, that's going to be a quality issue. So that's really what I mean by quality. Not is it in there, is it in there nicely, clearly, and easy, and does it bode well to the learning of the subject matter? So if you have any questions, wonderful. Let's Skype and talk about them. If not, I hope, oh, and uh, the due date is going to always, on all labs, will be shortly, uh, they'll be right at when the test is due. I'm sorry. So basically, I like to have it due the day of the test, and you're thinking, but I have the test. I don't want to, of course not. Uh, you shouldn't be doing anything last minute ever in this class. You should be studying for the test today, and you should be working on this lab today. The reason why I want the lab due the same as when the test due, it 
actually should be helping you tremendously learning some of the most important concepts that are going to be on the exam. So let's make sure that you have the lab finished before you take the test because it will make your test grade go up. All right. Again, let me know if you have any questions.